Ever wondered what happens when all the bitcoins are mined? Let's delve into the fascinating world of Bitcoin mining to answer this intriguing question. Bitcoin mining, in essence, is the process of solving complex mathematical problems. These solutions validate transactions on the Bitcoin blockchain, ensuring the integrity and security of the entire network. Now, here's the thing about Bitcoin. It's finite. Unlike traditional currencies that can be printed on demand, there is a hard limit set at 21 million Bitcoins. And we're already close to hitting that limit. As of this moment, we have mined over 18 and a half million Bitcoins. That's nearly 90% of all Bitcoins that will ever exist. With the majority of Bitcoins already in circulation, the question arises, what happens when we reach that final number? Stick around as we journey into the future of Bitcoin, exploring the implications and possibilities of a world where all Bitcoins are mined. To understand the future, we first need to grasp the present. So what exactly is Bitcoin mining? Let's break it down. Bitcoin mining is a bit like a digital treasure hunt, where miners use powerful computers to solve complex mathematical puzzles. These aren't your everyday Sudoku puzzles, though. They're intricate problems that require immense computational power to solve. As miners crack these puzzles, they're rewarded with bitcoins. But that's not all they're doing. These mathematical problems are tied to transactions made with bitcoins, so when the miners solve them, they're also validating these transactions, making sure they're legitimate. This double duty of creating new bitcoins and validating transactions is what keeps the bitcoin network running smoothly. It's a delicate balancing act that ensures the integrity of the system and keeps it secure from fraud. In essence, bitcoin mining is the backbone of the bitcoin network, ensuring its security and functionality. So why does bitcoin mining matter, you may ask? Well, it's the backbone that keeps the bitcoin network strong and secure. It's the miners who validate transactions, ensuring that no double spending occurs. They take unconfirmed transactions, verify them and spread them across the network. It's like they're the security guards of this digital realm, keeping everything in check. But that's not all. Bitcoin mining also serves as the mechanism that introduces new Bitcoins into the system. Now, this isn't a random process. It's carefully controlled to maintain a steady inflation rate. This ensures that the supply of Bitcoins doesn't suddenly skyrocket or plummet, keeping the market stable. So in essence, miners are the engine that drives the Bitcoin network. They validate transactions, maintain the system's integrity and manage the introduction of new Bitcoins. Without miners, the Bitcoin network would be susceptible to attacks and fraud and the steady flow of new Bitcoins would halt. So we return to our initial question. What happens when all Bitcoins are mined? Well, once the last Bitcoin has been dug out from the digital mines, the miners will no longer receive Bitcoin rewards for solving those complex mathematical problems. This is a significant shift, as these rewards have been the primary incentive for miners, yet they won't be left empty-handed. They will instead rely on transaction fees as their primary source of income. This shift could potentially alter the mining process. Without the lure of new Bitcoins, the number of miners might dwindle, which could lead to a concentration of mining power. This could potentially impact the decentralization that is the cornerstone of the Bitcoin network. The users might see changes too. With transaction fees becoming crucial, we might see a push for efficiency, leading to faster transaction times. As we inch closer to that final Bitcoin, the future remains uncertain. But one thing is certain, the world of Bitcoin will continue to evolve just as it has since its inception.